Welcome! In this video I'm going to be taking a look at this High Wings gaming laptop cooling pad. So this was provided to me by the distributor, but they're not compensating me for this video and they're not reviewing it before I post it. If you find this video helpful, I'll put a link to this in the description on Amazon, and if you use that link it helps me out a little bit and doesn't cost anything extra. So let's look at the back side here. I'm going to turn my light off, it has a lot of glare. It says equipped with four 140mm noise-free LED fans, three levels of inclination, ergonomic adjustable design, dual USB, can connect with laptops and charging devices, compatible with 17 inch or below. Product name is Notebook Cooler. Rated voltage is 0.35 amps. That says voltage, but it means current. Fan speed is 800 plus or minus 10%. Fan size is 140 by 140 by 15. Product size is 420 by 305 by 30 millimeters. Net weight is 850 grams. And it says compatible with 17 inch or below. So there's two colors here. There's blue LED and red LED. This one is the red. So here's the pad, USB cable. Here's a manual here. It says plug it into your computer, you can adjust the angle, and it says backlight and speed adjustment. So this has a metal mesh here. It has a little flip down with some foam on it to lean your computer against. This is all hard plastic here. Let's go to the bottom. We have openings here to allow air to go through. And here are the feet. So it looks like we have different feet here for different levels. Okay, I see how this works. So this is the foot that touches the desk surface. And then this little thing is a support for that. So you can put it in different positions, like so. On the back here, we have the plug to plug in the USB and we have the adjuster. So I will plug that in. And this is rubber here and here to keep it from slipping. So there we go. So I'm going to plug this into power so we can take a look at it. So you can plug this right into your laptop. I'm just going to plug it into the wall for now so we can examine it without a laptop on it. So the knob back here has a little click on it so it's off. I'll turn it on. Now this is spinning. I'll turn off these lights. If I turn it to the right, that's high. The left is low. It's very quiet. I'm going to turn off the overhead lights so you can better see the lights inside of here. So here we have the lights. So when it's down, they're dim. When I turn it up, they get a little brighter. There's not a huge difference in the brightness of the lights, but the fan does speed up. I don't think this is coming through very well on camera, so I'm actually going to take a picture of this and I'll merge that in with the video. Okay, so now I'll mount my laptop on here. So this is a smaller laptop. This is a 2015 MacBook Pro, but you can put a much larger laptop on here, a 17. So that fits on there very nicely. So this cooling pad is marketed towards gamers and it'd certainly be good for that. Now on this Mac here, I used to edit videos on this daily and it would get pretty hot when it was rendering videos. So I had a little laptop cooling pad, but it was nowhere as good as this one. This one has four fans, my other one had two, and this has a much larger mesh here to let the air flow around it. The other one just had two little ports on it. This thing's definitely not restricting the air, so it's going to let a lot of air flow around. So the laptop itself, every laptop's gonna be different in how it cools itself. This one has a fan back here that it pulls the air through. But any heat you can take away from the computer anywhere on the computer is going to cool it down overall. So if this is cooling down the exterior, it has less work for the computer to do to cool it with its own fans. Also, the airflow coming out of this is going to take that hot air coming out of the vents on the computer and blow them out further. So of course we can adjust the height on this. So that's a little higher. And that's all the way up. So on this 13 inch MacBook Pro, with this in the highest position, the top of the monitor is around 14 inches high. So if you had a 17 inch laptop, it's going to be a little bit higher than that. The very back of this is around six inches high. So if you take your screen height plus six inches, if you have a full size laptop, that's gonna be about how high it's going to be off the desktop surface. And I do have this plugged into the power supply, but I can easily plug this into the computer itself. Like so. So now it's being powered from the computer and there's a USB port in the back. So if you're running a lot of data through, I don't know that this would support like USB 3 protocols. I'm guessing it doesn't. But if you had like a keyboard mouse dongle, you could plug that in the back or some other peripheral that doesn't require really high speeds. 
So I'll take the laptop off. It's kind of hard to demonstrate this and show it at the same time. So that's the High Wings Gaming Laptop Cooling Pad. So I think this is a great option if you have a laptop and it gets really hot when you're doing heavy gaming, processing, video editing, things like that. This can cool down your computer. It can increase the life of your components of your computer. It can prevent throttling, which is when your computer slows down due to too much heat. And I like that this cools things down without being very loud. Being that there's four fans here that can run at a lower RPM than having, say, a single fan that has to run really fast to move a lot of air, these were very quiet, so they're not gonna disrupt your computing experience. It also has those cool red lights on there. So that's all I'm going to cover in this video. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comments. If you like this video, please click like. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, I'd appreciate if you could do that. And thanks for watching. Until next time, goodbye.